I'm in the middle of the fog, so there is 0% visibility and I mean, it's terrible. <laughs> What's up guys, welcome back to my channel and in this new video. Today I'm in a fantastic area of Dolomites called Dolomiti Friulane. I've already been here a couple days ago. I shot another adventure video that you can find in the description. And today I'm hiking to a pretty iconic spot called Campanile di Val Montanaia. It's a crazy tower standing in the middle of a very very wild narrow valley. It's a very famous place in the area and I'm sure you're gonna love it but I'm not gonna stop there. I will keep hiking to reach a ridge right over it from where there is a fantastic view to another mountain called Crodacimoriana and to the Dolomites on the other side. I will spend the night there so I have my big Shimoda 70 liters backpack uh, I'm super late because it's 5 p.m. and it's a long hike. Trust me, it's really long. So it's time to go. The weather is not extraordinary. There are quite a lot of clouds, but the forecast is promising. So I don't know what's gonna happen. I hope it's gonna clear up for Milky Way, but we'll see. I don't really know. So stay tuned. It's going to be awesome. Panina, peeking out of the fog. Amazing. There's a mountain goat. I just arrived to this bivouac which should be in front of the spectacular tower of Campanile but I'm in the middle of the fog. The weather is terrible, there is 0% visibility but I'm hopeful there's still some time for sunset and even if it doesn't clear up for sunset there's still a possibility for night sky or sunrise so there is a bit of light coming through the fog, so everything can happen. I decided not to hike up till the ridge because, I mean, it doesn't make sense. So I will set the tent somewhere around here because it's not allowed to stay in the bivouac. And I will hope and wait.
I'm getting quite tired of taking sandwiches in the mountains so I'm trying to experiment with different kind of food and boiled eggs are working amazing. It's almost 9.30, sunset is gone, and nothing has changed. I think this is also a good lesson for all photographers, because photography is all about waiting. Waiting for the best season, waiting for the best day with the best conditions, and, uh, and then waiting for the best light and waiting for the perfect moment to freeze and capture in your shot. So what I'm gonna do is to keep an eye on the sky. If it clears up, I'm gonna start shooting. The weather forecast says that it should clear up because tomorrow it is predicted to be nice weather, sunny weather, so it will clear up for sure. The thing is when, so we'll see. Good night. Eleven thirty, let's check out outside. Not good. Half past midnight. It's getting windy, so maybe the wind is helping to remove the fog. Let's see. Ooh. It's clearing up. The clouds finally disappeared. I hiked a little higher to get a better view of the valley with the tower in the middle and the Milky Way right over it. And it's amazing. The sky is fantastic. The stars are super clear, no light pollution, it's amazing. I think I'll have a little rest.
morning. It's almost 5 a.m. I'm hiking to reach that ridge up there and have a look at this. Low clouds are laying in the valley. Campanile is standing right in the middle. Moon is in the sky. Crazy mountains all around. It's incredible. I'm starting to be tired, 
because I didn't sleep very much tonight. I mean, when I was in the tent, I slept perfectly, but the thing is, I stayed in the tent for like three hours, so I'm starting to be tired. But I've been super happy to visit this place again and to show you to you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the photos and the aerial videos that I took. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and see you in the next adventure.